Hey guys, welcome back to part 137 of Summertime Saga. I'm Miss Kitty 2K and I want to explore the church. Cool, I've never been on this side of the confessional. Mm, looks the same as the other side actually. I should get out of here. Yeah, it's pretty the same. Bless me father for I have sinned. Father? There's no one in here. I guess there's no prize around at this time. Yeah. Oh, very cool. Ooh. Uh, what? The, what? Oh my god. The church! This ball is massive. I wonder how Ben Dover was connected to it. Maybe he helped to build it. It sure looks really old. And there's an engraving on it too, just like the tombstone. Hmm. Looks like some kind of stone altar with trees around it and the moon shining go down. One of the trees had a hole in it too. I wonder what's up with that. Where could I find something like this in Somerville? Well, I have already found this. <sighs> hmm. Yeah. Cool. Are you from this parish, young man? Hi, I was one. Are you from this parish, young man? Uh, not really. Do you believe in God? Well, I'm sorry, I can only help those who share the faith of our Lord. <coughs> Calm your ass down, okay? So, we have already visited this point, but we did it, so yeah. <coughs> and now... Well, <laughs> I don't know, actually. Maybe we should just go back to her home and the cemetery and see okay so let's just bend over we have seen the bell then in the church we have seen the altar oops sorry the altar which is this one wait let me go upstairs once more and see okay let me see the Hoods. I'm just curious. Okay, this just be something like a halter. A strange stone structure stands in the middle of the forest. It looks old, completely overgrown in moss. And there's sunlight shining directly upon it. This must be what I'm looking for. Hmm, this looks like the altar that was on the church bell. But something's not right. This just looks like a dead end. Hmm, what were the clues again? A stone altar with trees around it and the moon shining down. I should think it over. Yeah, well, I should come at night. Yeah. Meanwhile, oh yeah. Let's see. Okay. Well, that's strange. It looks like the moon is affecting the altar somehow. These symbols must be important and it looks like I can move them around to make a picture. Maybe it's some kind of puzzle? Um, is there something I could touch? Yeah. Oh, right. I didn't... Oh, sorry, this was my phone. Ah, I don't know, I'm just doing it all... Fuck it up completely. Okay. I'm kidding. Like this and like this. <laughs> I don't know, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Maybe like this. Um. Nah. This can't be like this. Mm. Let me see. Um, I'm just curious. <sighs> I really want to know how is that. Maybe it's not like this. But wait. I will try to do this, okay, on my own. Then I will show you how it's gone. Sorry, I found it because I the scroll I found into the hole of that tree. 
I watched it. It was a moon. I made it. Now I have the treasure map. I will definitely check it. There it is. It is so cool. An actual treasure map. Mm, looks like a drawing on the coast. And that should be our local beach. And here there's an axe on a small island. I wonder what it leads to. But it's better to discover it another time. We should go and sleep. Let's consult Mia. Okay, Mia is outside, but where? She must be in the church then. So, like, we are the sheep, right? And God, he's like our shepherd, see? Okay, what? That's Keanu Reeves. That's Keanu Reeves. Keanu Reeves, sorry. Keeves, you see? Keeves, Keanu Reeves. Oh, fuck. This is so amazing. I love this game. He's trying to protect us from wolves and what not, while leading us down a path to greener pastures, which I'm pretty sure is code for heaven or something. And you definitely want to go to heaven, cause like, there's tons of hot babes there and cool dudes surfing on clouds, plus nobody has to work anymore so you can just chill all day. Wolves will be like, crazing around with little angel wings and eating corn nuts and nachos all day. Yeah, everything will be truly excellent. So, wait, what was I talking about again? Communion, Father? Oh, yeah. Totally. <clears throat> we will not be having communion this week. Or somebody, not gonna say who, got the munchies last night and dipped into the communion wafers. Mm. Ha, <laughs> but not worry. I ordered a bunch more and we'll continue the services next week with delicious wine and everything cool. Right, so uh, we should probably move on the passing around the collection plate. Sister Angelica is gonna be is gonna do the honors, and you all just um, well donate all you can, but don't feel obliged. You know, cause the wild god appreciates generosity and smiles down upon those who can give is totally not a requirement. If you cannot buy your way to heaven, but you could probably get yourself a card closer to the heavenly sashi machine. <laughs> Whizzing the Jews. This guy knows what I'm talking about. It will be the most triumphant. Okay, okay, you are losing my time. You know, I haven't been to church in a while, but I don't remember it being like this. There's definitely something off about that price. Mm, I should speak with him and investigate. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Maria is giving a head. There is major rump. Annie, Mia and her family. Okay, I can't do this now. Right now. Um, hi. Hey, how's it going, little dude? First time here? Yeah. Excellent. Be welcomed in the house of the Lord and what not. I'm Father Keeves, and this bodacious babe next to me with the massive chesticles is Sister Angelica. Father! You can't say things like... No, sorry guys. You can't say things like that. Huh? It's improper. Oh, sorry, sister. That's my bad. Not a bodacious babe. She's a very pious young woman. She's very sexy, guys. Don't you think? She's so attractive. I love nuns. With tremendous jigs, jugs. Oh, Lord. Give me strength. So, did you enjoy the sermon? Huh? Oh, um, yeah. It was very unique. Excellent. Yeah, that's what I was going for. You see, I like to promote a chill environment for the congregation. It really brings people closer together. Oh, really? Yeah, or at least that's what Jesus told me once. You've spoken with you? What? You've spoken with Jesus? Like the Jesus? Oh, totally. I met him backstage at Wild Silence concert back in the 91. You met Jesus Christ backstage at a rock concert? No, Jesus, he meant this dude. He was like, you guys took my breath away tonight. And I was all like, no, you're breathtaking, Jesus. You're breathtaking. And he was like, party on, Ted. Heh. <laughs> then we all lit up some dude bitch and had met meatball subs. It was a must triumphant time. So wait, you were in a band? Ha, huh, yeah, totally. My best friend Bill and I, plus a couple babes from the 40s. The 140s. <sighs> There were there was the buzz incident, buzz incident. Yeah, so okay, he's kinda um, losing my time. 
a weirdo type. Wait a second, you have to attend the confessions. Take a chill pill, sister. I need a Canadian bacon and sausage inside me as soon as possible. Father! Okay, that guy is either mental or the coolest prize on the planet. Either way, I'm intrigued. Amazing! Let's see if there is something I can check around here. Uh, nah, nothing. <sighs> Alright, guys, I think I will close it here. I have made a couple of longer episodes. <sighs> Just be patient, guys. We are going through it. <sighs> see you in my next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>